Today I'm going to show you how to install and run WhisperLive Kit locally, a powerful, open-source tool that gives you real-time speech-to-text and speaker identification right in your browser, with no cloud required. We'll go step-by-step -step through installation, launching the server, and testing it out, plus I'll highlight advanced features like different backends, speaker diarization, and Docker support. Whether you want to transcribe meetings, podcasts, or just explore cutting-edge AI on your own machine, WhisperLive Kit makes it lightning fast, private, and easy to use. If you are new to my YouTube channel, subscribe it and press bell icon to stay updated. Let's dive in how to install this locally on your computer. Click on GitHub link in my description to go to main page of real-time WhisperLive Kit. To install this locally, you don't need any GPU, it runs smoothly on CPU, all you need Python 3.10.11 and FFmpeg to path. You can install FFmpeg by watching video link in my description. To install, click on code option and download main zip file. After downloading Notebook, extract it where you want to install this. After extracting, go inside Extracted Folder and type CMD in Folder Path. A new command window will open. Now create Venv using Python 3.10. Activate Ven with activation code. Now go to PyTorch main page and copy code for CPU. Copy and paste code in command window to install Torch. After Torch installed, copy code of Whisper installation and paste in command window to install. Whisper installed copy main code from main page and paste in command window to run. You can change default language by changing language code. To fix this error install Torch Audio with pip code.
Now run main code again. This will download models needed. When you see local URL copy and paste local URL in any web browser to launch Whisper Toolkit. To use this again make a bat file of this. Go to main folder and create new text file. Open text file and type this code as you see and save as run.bat. Now you can easily run this again by double-clicking this run file. To use this click on record option choose your microphone or any input audio device. Allow mic to record. This will turn anything spoken into text with speaker name. You can make script of podcast do many things with this tool. This tool work in real time. You can also use it for translating videos and make subtitles for them with FFmpeg help. You can save it as SRT or text file. I hope you like this video. If you got any question or request comment, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and give a like. Take care.